I got my boo sign over there, I got my fake spider over there, and I also got an owl behind me. So yeah, we're just all set for Halloween. What's up guys, it's Taylor, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is super exciting and that is because it is my first Halloween video of 2016, as you guys can probably already tell by my background. And let me know down in the comments below what you guys think of my new background because I really, really like my new background and I just wanna know what you guys think. But anyways, today's video is gonna be a Halloween treat ideas video and oh my gosh, you guys don't know how excited I am because you guys know I love food and everything that I made in this video turned out so yummy and I only have one treat left because I. I already ate all the other ones. So I'm going to be calling my Halloween series this year hashtag Taylorween. So if you guys recreate any of the treats that I show in this video or just anything throughout my whole Halloween series in general, then definitely tweet me or like Snapchat me a picture because I would love to see your guys' recreations. Also, if you guys are new to my channel, then you should definitely click that red subscribe button so you can get notified every single time that I upload a new video. And also, you guys can join the Tebe family and I would love to have you guys as part of the family. And yeah, I think that's pretty much all I wanted to say for this intro. So now now let's just go and get started with the video. All right, so the very first treat we're gonna be making is this candy corn popcorn, and oh my gosh, you guys, I love this so much, and it was so good. And what you'll need for this is popcorn, M&Ms, butter, candy corn, food coloring, and marshmallows. And I first started out by microwaving my popcorn, and then I just laid it out on a baking sheet with some wax paper, because you don't want it to stick. And then I just spreaded the popcorn out. Baby, pull me closer in the back. And now it's time to add on your toppings, so I made the marshmallow a mixture which consists of three tablespoons of butter and three cups of marshmallows and I melted that on the stove for a few minutes until it melted and I added yellow food coloring to it to make it look like butter on popcorn and I also added M&Ms some mini marshmallows and also some candy corn And then after that, I just let it harden for about a half an hour, and this is what it looks like whenever it's done, and this is definitely my favorite treat that I made. Okay, so the second treat are these Oreo eyeball cookies, and all you need for this is three ingredients, which are Oreos, M&Ms, and decorating gel, which is basically icing. And first I just started by taking the top part off the Oreos and then I just took the icing side of the cookie and I just added like a big glob of the gel icing, basically like a penny sized amount and I used blue and green icing. And then I just added the M&Ms on top of the icing to act as the pupil of the eye. And then I just took some of the gel icing but in red and added lines to make it look like veins on the eyes. And then I just repeated the same steps until I had as many as I wanted. The girls, when the girls talk, when the girls talk, boys. Oh, when the girls, when the girls talk, when the girls... And yeah, that's pretty much it for this treat idea. And if you guys like Oreos and icing, then you would definitely love this treat. And I just think it's like perfect for like a Halloween party. I didn't know that I was starving till I tasted you. And the last thing that we're going to be making are these pretzel pumpkins and I think that these are so adorable and they're super yummy too. And all you need for this is some pretzels, some M&Ms, and also some candy coating. Okay, so the first thing you're going to want to do is melt your chocolate and I just used a bag of white chocolate chips and melted it down and added red and yellow food coloring and mixed that all together to make the orange. And then all you want to do is take your pretzels and roll them around in the chocolate until the pretzels are completely covered and then just put them on a baking sheet with some wax paper so that they don't stick. And then the last step is to add the green M&Ms for the stem of the pumpkin and I just put them in the crease at the top of the pretzel. And this is how they turned out and if you guys like white chocolate then this is definitely the treat for you. So 
yeah, that was the video, guys. And I really hope you guys enjoyed my first Halloween video of 2016. And if you did enjoy this video, then definitely give it a big old thumbs up for me because that really helps me out a lot. And also, if you guys haven't already, then definitely make sure you guys follow me on all of my social media, like my Instagram, my Twitter, and my Snapchat. And I try to be really active on all of my social media, especially my Twitter, because that's where I like to talk to you guys the most. So yeah, I think that's pretty much all I have to say for this outro. I love you guys, and I will see you in my next video. Bye! So I can learn